Brian here with Help Sell My RV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful, fully loaded 2021 Forest River FR3 30DS double slide Class A gas motorhome. Overall exterior length is 31 feet, 8 inches, and the exterior height to the dual AC units is 12 feet, 5 inches. This is a one owner coach. The owners have only owned it for a short time. Uh, it was kind of an impulsive buy, which usually it is when you buy an RV. But anyway, um, they admitted that uh, they prob probably wasn't the best idea to buy this thing because they're, they're retired. They're done RVing. So they gave me a call. I'm going to rate this 1 through 10, 10 being the best. Excellent. Any dealer would agree. This would be a showroom pre-owned piece. I'm going to try to show it off, show off why. Oh, I do want to point out, it's been stored all its life in that barn right there. It's never seen salt, never seen snow. All right, I'm going to start my video up in the cockpit area and then work my way back because of the power lift bunk. I do have the power lift bunk up. The, the motors are always slow to go up and down. So anyway, I didn't want to bore you for the video. But anyway, you get the idea. It's a power lift bump, uh, overhead bunk, and it sleeps uh, one adult comfortably or if you want to sleep two kiddos definitely they could uh, manage up there I think it's rated at 350 degrees there's a ladder up there that locks into this when this is down right there anyway you get the idea all right this is sitting on the new design chassis and it's got the 7.3 liter v8 which is the godzilla engine that everybody talks about it's 350 horsepower 468 foot pounds of torque swiveling co-pilot and pilot seats obviously not sure what the fabric is but i'll try to show it off here after i talk about the chassis uh it does have the uh more ride upfit upgrade on the suspension for a smoother ride i'll show off the mileage real quick there you go 905 miles it's only been up to or been to mammoth cave and back which is local here and uh, it's been somewhere up in southern indiana for a wedding all righty start from the left and work my way to the right uh four point auto leveling these are your headlights and your side mirror controls here this is going to be map lights fog lights and the new dash design got to zoom in on or back up on that kind of show off that low doghouse i'll back up and show that low doghouse now which is really convenient to get in and out of the pilot and co-pilot seat the brand new dash has the new touch screen stereo and this does show your side view camera and your backup camera this does have three point camera package on this coach and temperature controls here easy to figure out your buttons here uh, this is going to be your heat heated mirrors battery boost button ties your house battery and chassis battery together in case your chassis battery is dead you do have power shades you get the idea on that so you don't have a curtain anymore you got these nice clean shades and you do have pull down blackout shades on the side for the pilot and co-pilot so at night you bring all these shades down and you have privacy so you don't have to worry about that ugly curtain that they used to offer uh, radio switch off and on and outside sp uh, speakers you do have outside speakers on this coach uh, LED lights you get the idea and your stereo ties into your smart device it's got all the good stuff on it kind of back up here show off that new dash design I'm gonna try to show off all the new stuff that they offered and that's all new down there see that that uh, rubber it's kind of like a diamond plating for the pilot co-pilot seat pretty nice look at that 110 outlets 12 volt outlet here USB charging right there nice workstation area for the co-pilot I'm not sure what they're calling this fabric, but it's, it's like the same stuff that they put on patio furniture. Stain resistant, all the good stuff. There, lock that in. There you go. And that doghouse is real low. That's nice. There is a table that goes here. It's a pole and a little table, and I'll show that to you when we're back in the main bedroom. Nice little safety mirror, so when you're driving, make sure nobody's uh, standing up if you have to break automatically or uh, in an emergency. It's double slide coach first slide out it's going to be a super slide it's about the 12 maybe 14 foot long three foot deep accommodates the theater seating same fabric as on the pilot and co-pilot seat you do have seat belts obviously all 
Also in the super slide is the boot dinette. That breaks down into a bed. You can sleep two adults comfortably on that. And you do have storage up underneath. This is that foil wrap. It looks like a marble top, but uh, anyway, they, they put this all throughout the coach, even in the kitchen and in the bathroom. You do have the blackout roller blinds all throughout. Those are the ones you want. Kind of show off the window treatments. And I do know the colors of the cabinets. It's called a fossil maple. I usually forget to look up the color of the cabinets, but anyway. Oh, hind hidden hinges. That's new, I think, for 2021 because they used to show the hinges on the outside. That's definitely nice. Oh, and the boot dinette, the fabric is the same as uh, the pilot and co-pilot seat and the theater seating. No wear or tear on this coach whatsoever. Kitchen area, you do have an add a leaf and that's that wrap marble look top. And you do have, this is all new, uh, the bamboo cutting board that they offer with the coaches now. And you still have the farmer's sink. Got a little strainer here for dishes. Forgot, uh, I think it's gonna be about a 32, uh, I'm sorry, a 42 inch flat screen. And uh, that TV does open up back behind it. There's cabinets space behind that. Microwave by Magic Chef. And I believe this is new because uh, they used to just have a backsplash, but now they have a side splash. That's nice. Three burner gas cooktop. You'd have a glass lid. That may have been part of a package for more counter space. Nice cleaner look. Front burners, usually a high output, 22 inch oven. Oh, this is cool. There you go. A little bit more counter space. That's neat. That forest fur does. Refrigerator is going to be a 12 cubic foot gas and electric refrigerator. And it's going to be by Norcold. Show off the Norcold badge there. Got to show off the refrigerators. There you go. You get the idea. Huge pantry next to the refrigerator. Always got to show the pantries. Your flooring is going to be that plank wood floor look. It's the high grade vinyl flooring and it's all throughout. Easy to clean. Nice digital thermostat here. You do have the WineGuard 360 here. It's a antenna booster and uh, for 4G. Basically a hotspot for Wi-Fi, which is nice. Central command here. I'll show that while we're walking back. Yeah, let's show off the bedroom. Second slide out is going to be a king bed. And you do have 110 hookups on each side of the bed and USB charging ports right there and right there. And you do have a little shelf on each side of the bed too, which is nice. Oh, reader lights, LED lights there. Headboard's gonna be that uh, fossil maple wood finish. It's gonna be your second television. It's gonna be like a 32 inch flat screen. And again, you can lift that up and there's storage back behind it. This coach is fully loaded, does have the satellite on it, and it does have the washer and dryer. There's your table that goes in between the pilot and co-pilot seat, a little bar that sets up. Look at that owner's manual. The owners are so meticulous, which I love. They were so worried about how clean or how dirty this thing was. It is dirty on the outside, but anyway, I told them do not worry about it. Satellite on this, they spent about $1,500 after they purchased the coach for a satellite to be installed up on the roof. Look at that. 12 volt hookups, 110 there. Washer and dryer combo unit by Splendid. There you go. Another thermostat control there, digital thermostat control. Glass enclosed shower with skylight. And this door comes and closes off here for privacy. And I'll turn around here and show you. And you do have a pocket door here 
that closes off for privacy? A little locking mechanism. There you go. And a nice pocket door back in here for privacy from the living room. Foot flush toilet, uh, china to or porcelain toilet. That is going to be new. That used to be plastic. The owners were so worried about this screen being dirty with the bugs in it because it's been stored in their barn. I told them not worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's a beautiful coach. There's a little cushion right there that goes in between the two cushions and the boot dinette so it breaks down into a bed. All right, central command here. It's going to be where you're on your levels. LP tank is going to be a 24.5 gallon LP tank, batteries. Freshwater tank is going to be a 52 gallon freshwater tank and your black tank, which is your toilet, is going to be 42 gallons and your gray tank, which is your sink and shower, it's going to be 42 gallons. Water heater, 6 gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater. Uh, generator start and stop button, not sure if you can see it. Generator only has 17 hours on the Jenny. Uh, uh, an hour is me being here. It does have the uh, Arctic package on this, heated uh, holding tanks on this. And water pump switch, slide one button, slide two button, easy to figure out. There we go. Fantastic vent fan. Your AC units are dual AC units with uh, the front one offering the heat pump and the defra uh, dehumidifier. So that's a neat feature and it does have the quick dump. Your furnace on this is gonna be a 35,000 BTU furnace. All right, I think I got everything on the inside. Let's go ahead and go outside. Oh, you do have a solar panel on this. And I believe it's 300 watt solar panel. Anyway, and it's attached to the roof, so. And that may have been new for 2021 also. Switches for your awning and uh, your battery disconnect to save you on your battery when you're in storage and step but lights and awning lights and lock the overhead cab power bunk All right. back up here beautiful coach beautiful front cap all LED lights you do have a one piece windshield with the FR3 badge there up in the corner it's a little windy here so that's why I've got the uh, awning in but it's a 16 foot power awning LED lights are all connected to the wall so when the awning is in you still have patio lights which is nice sometimes you won't get that there's your 7.3 liter v8 badge there the godzilla engine 350 horsepower 468 foot pounds of torque there's one of your side cameras right there 19.5 wheels tires are obviously in excellent condition outside speakers uh, I think that's about a 32 inch flat screen three flat screens on this coach This is pretty much fully loaded hydraulics for your full point auto level Slam latch package doors got a level all your compartment door or compartments are all rotocast You can clean them out real easy hose them out and there's a little drain there and you do have hookups for uh, USB uh, What's that 12 volt? 110. Look at that. Low point drain valves. Here's your uh, water pump and your holding tanks. And again, they're all heated. Six gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater. This is going to be your 35,000 BTU furnace service panel. Nice Forest River FR3 badge there. All your decals are in excellent condition. Another storage compartment. The owners do have a lot of stuff that they bought when they bought the coach. Uh, it's not going with it, but if you're interested in the extra stuff that they have, uh, just talk to them. They might work something out. That was a LP gas quick disconnect on that that I just showed you in that door in case you want to hook up a gas grill. Pass through storage on a Class A gas. Almost unheard of. Huge storage, by the way, for a 31, almost 32 footer. 
slide out awning package you do have awnings over the slide outs ladder to get up on your full walk-on fiberglass roof crowned roof usually it's going to be a rubber roof that is the roof you want fiberglass 5,000 pound towing capability 5,000 pound hitch seven-way pigtail all all ready look at that look how beautiful that is look at that 80 gallon fuel cell right there there's your full point auto level jacks absolutely beautiful coach look at the little magnets I always say they should have done that a long time ago and that's that pass-through storage you got the idea slam latch baggage doors 80 gallon fuel cell water hookups right here freshwater tank again 52 gallon and anyway I gave you your sizes outside shower there's your dump valves all enclosed here nice and clean you do have LED lights all throughout your compartments forgot to point that out another storage there it's dirty there's your 5500 5, Yamaha with inverter technology that's definitely cool another storage I think these are insulated baggage doors. I'll have to check on that. There's your OP tank. Let's back up. Show off that color scheme. The sun's going to get me. Beautiful coach. I think I got everything. If I didn't, I do apologize. This is a fully loaded Class A gas motorhome. It's not entry level. FR3s are one of the most popular gas motorhomes on the market for obvious reasons. She's sharp. Anyway, if you want to come and see the coach, call the number on the ad. You always deal directly with the owner, or you can call 502-645-3124. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up on YouTube. And if you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale by owner in the Louisville, Kentucky area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube.